That's why you always see me with either bangs or hair on the side of my face because there's always a line, uh, an eyebrow pencil line going across the wrinkle. I, that morning, about a week and a half, two weeks ago, I went to draw my eyebrow on and realized that that line was smooth. Not completely gone, but it was smooth. It was softer. It caught my attention. I It was on this side. I immediately went over to this side to look to see if I had the same result. And sure enough, this side had softened too. My forehead lines are softening. Therein lies my dilemma. I don't know if I'm seeing the result from the Link Beauty Power Phytoceramides, or I don't know if I'm seeing a result from the uh, Rosehip Oil with the vitamin E. I don't know. Maybe it's a combination of the two. I will tell you that about two weeks after I started using this combination, I had something that I've never had in my entire life. I had a breakout. And it wasn't just one pimple, it was three. I had one here, one here, and one right, right under my chin or my jawline, I knew what it was. And they did eventually go away. Uh, I was watching just this morning, Susan again uh, from Little Poet, and she was talking in her video about going to the dermatologist. And she mentioned to him about the rosehip oil, and she mentioned to him that I had told her that I had a breakout, and possibly from the rosehip oil. And he told her that you should really use your, use your moisturizer and put a drop or two of the rosehip oil in your moisturizer and then use it. That a lot of times with rosehip oil, um, it's just too strong in the beginning. Well, I really didn't notice it being too strong in the beginning because I would put about a pump or a pump and a half in the palm of my hand and just put it all over my face. I never had any redness from it or any irritation or any burning. It was, it was just fine. But uh, now that I've sort of, I think I'm through this breakup period, I probably won't go back and add it to my moisturizer. I do put my moisturizer on though after I use my rosehip oil, so there wouldn't be really that much difference. My experience with the rosehip oil, I will continue to use this. I absolutely love this. I'm addicted to the woodsy smell. I've even purchased uh, two other brands of this. One, the Pure Essential Oil, and the other one, I can't remember what it is, but I haven't tried either one of those. When I finish this, and this is gonna last me a long, long time, I've been using it, what, a month and a half at least, and I am only to where the label starts, right there. So this is gonna last a while. The phytoceramides. I am definitely going to continue to use these. As a matter of fact, I've already ordered a second bottle. And the first bottle was on the Link Beauty People. They sent them to me for free to try and review, uh, but I, purchased the second bottle myself. I'm gonna to continue to take these for a few months actually, to be sure. I uh, did ask if uh, they had an auto delivery type program where I could just have these sent to me automatically once a month, and they don't. I could just uh, bite the bullet and buy, you know, a few months supply at one time, and I may break down and do that but they're less than $20. I, I wanna say they're about $18. Most of you know I'm a vegetarian. I eat a really good diet 90% of the time. Uh, I get a lot of my nutrients. I live in Florida. I'm out in the sun all the time, so I'm getting vitamin D. Uh, I, I just rarely take supplements, so I'm not spending money on supplements. So I truly don't have a problem with spending, you know, 
18 or $20 a month on the phytoceramides as long as I feel like I'm getting some results from them. Now, I know when I tried phytoceramides the last time and they didn't appear to work, uh, many of you came back and told me that you use different brands that work. So I would imagine that there are some brands out there that work uh, for different people. But uh, since I feel like these are contributing to the results I'm seeing, uh, I'm going to continue to just stick with this brand. I am very, very, very happy that Stuart with the Link Beauty Company was persistent in trying to get me to try these phytoceramides. And I am so happy that Susan from Little Poet told us all about the restoring rosehip oil with the vitamin E. I'm loving both of them. I could not recommend both of them anymore based on the results that I've seen. No one, not, not my husband, not my daughter, not my friends who see me every day have said to me, what are you doing to your face? You look better or you, your wrinkles aren't as prominent. No one has said that to me, but it is definitely something that I can see for myself. And it's especially obvious when I draw on that tail of my eyebrows. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.